We're learning more this afternoon about the victims and how speed and weather may have been key factors in this wreck. News 8 Danielle Zolkowski has our story. The Indiana State University community is mourning the loss of three students after a car accident here in the town of Riley early Sunday morning. Every year seems like when school first starts, something always happens. And so I was really sad that they um, passed away because welcome week is always the best week. You know what I'm saying? Everybody's getting to know each other and stuff. The crash killed ISU football team members Christian Eubanks and Caleb Van Hooser and fellow classmate Jaden Musilli. Two other football team members, Omari and Dixon and John Moore survived, but with critical injuries. Uh, just the overall tragedy of events, just being here, knowing that, you know, you got kids, you send your kids here, you know, the overall goal is to make sure they see their way through. So, you know, it's just a specific tragedy that you know, they're uh, so young. A sheriff's department crash report obtained by News 8 today suggests the car was traveling 90 miles an hour on State Road 46 before crashing into a tree and catching fire. One of the surviving students told investigators the group was returning from a house party in Bloomington where all five had been drinking. Another witness told police the crash happened during a heavy downpour and it was very hard to see at the time. But it's not that much of a curb if you if you're going, the speed limit through here is supposed to be 30 mile an hour. Pruitt says crashes are an issue on this area of 46. There's been three or four, and I've lived here for about 20 years. And most of them has been not good for the people that was driving because they're not with us any longer. University officials released a statement saying counseling services will be available to students, faculty, and staff. I'm Danielle Zulkowski for Wish TV, wishtv.com, and follow us on Facebook.